Hello friends and welcome to a new video. If you are new, my name is Bronte and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a bit of a follow up to the last video I made. So if you haven't checked that one out yet, make sure you go do that and then come back here. I'll leave the link in the description for you guys if you want to go check that one out. But I went back to Trader Joe's. Yes, I'm already mildly addicted, but there's a lot of really good things. So I went back and yeah, so that is what we're doing today. I'm gonna share the best, the worst, and some new stuff from Trader Joe's. So let's go ahead and start with my favorite things. This shouldn't be a surprise to anyone, but everything but the bagel seasoning, I have fallen in love. I put it on every breakfast that I make and I'm still looking for more recipes, but I mean, who doesn't love everything but the bagel seasoning, right? Next is another one that I shouldn't be that surprised by, because Chinese food is one of my favorite things, but the frozen orange chicken, I mean, I've had lots of different brands of frozen orange chicken before, and it seems like you either get the crunch or you get good flavor and you kind of don't end up getting both until now. This is both the nice crispy outside and has super good flavor to it, so this is definitely one of my new favorite things. All right, and then this is actually one that was kind of fun to find because I wasn't really planning on getting it, but then I saw it at the store and I was like, mm -hmm, I kind of want to try it because it's so cute. But the little mini ice cream cones, I loved these. They're such a nice little snack to have after your dinner and I just really love them. They have the little chocolate in the bottom and it's just the perfect size and so picked up more of those, definitely one of my favorite things. Okay, now let's talk about what did not go very well last time. For starters, the basil plant that I bought. Now, this very well could be a me problem and not a Trader Joe's problem, but I bought the basil plant. I was very excited to have a basil plant and just have it to access whenever I wanted to cook something that had basil in it but unfortunately it died like the day after I brought it home and I tried watering it more. I tried watering it less, but it just kept getting worse and worse. And I'm gonna blame it on Trader Joe's because it died right away when I brought it home. So I don't think it was me, but yeah, that was pretty disappointing because I was so excited for it. So that was one of the fails from our first trip. Next was one that was kind of surprising to me because I didn't even really feature it in my first video, but we got oat milk just to have as a staple grocery item. And I kind of ended up hating it. When you drink it, you could feel a grittiness between your teeth, which is not very desirable at all when you're having your morning beverages. But uh, yeah, that was kind of shocking for me that the oat milk was kind of a bummer. I guess I'm just a tried and true Chobani girl for life. All right, and the last thing that I didn't like was the fish sticks. You guys, I know I put a little pop up in the first video saying like, don't buy them, they're so bad, but I, I have to tell you more. They're the worst thing I've had in such a long time. And I'm shocked because so many of the other things that we got were really, really good, but these were just like shockingly bad. They were dry somehow and the, the fish was dry, the breading was dry and there was like no flavor. I just, everything was bad about it. Don't get them, avoid at all costs. I cannot reverse recommend them enough. They're horrible. All right. And lastly, let's talk about some of the new things that I got. So one of the things that I got in the last video was the white cheddar shells mac and cheese, and it was really, really good. So I decided to get a different kind of mac and cheese, just the more classic cheddar mac and cheese. Yeah, I really loved the one we got last time, so I'm hopeful that this is gonna be just as good. I love having mac and cheese on hand. It's easy, it's delicious, and I just am never disappointed when I have mac and cheese for lunch. All right, and then another thing that I picked up last time that no one recommended to me, but I ended up really liking was the mini chicken tacos. So this time I decided to try the mini beef tacos. They're just these little tiny tacos that you heat up in the microwave or they're probably better in the oven, but I just did in the microwave and I love them. So we're trying out the beef ones this time because I love the chicken ones so much. All right, and then lastly is another everything but the bagel seasoning thing. And like I said, I love the seasoning itself. Last time we got the mixed nuts with everything but the seasoning on them and love them. So this time we're trying the chips. I just can't imagine that these are not delicious, but when I saw them in the store, when we were there shopping, I was like, yeah, we gotta do it, we gotta do it. So now that I'm looking at all of this delicious food, I'm getting hungry, so maybe I should get into these right now and let you know. Maybe not. 
please hold. Apparently they want you to work for your chips, which I find rude. Oh, they smell super good. I'm unsure. Let's try one that has more seasoning on it. Cause that first one was a little weird. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yep, it checks out. <laughs> They're delicious. So if you've never had the chips with everything but the bagel seasoning, go get them because they're very, very good. All right, guys, that is my little follow-up to my first trip to Trader Joe's. These were my favorite things, the worst things that I got and some new stuff that I'm excited to try. Let me know what your guys' favorites are from Trader Joe's because as I said, I am mildly addicted and I'm not against feeding that addiction. So let me know what your favorites are so I can try them too. And if you've seen a few of my videos and are not subscribed already, make sure you do that so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. And with that, I will see you guys in the next one. This is